let us bow down and look to God in prayer. Heavenly Father, may our Christmas season be a time of reconciliation and peace. May the love of God be with us. May his peace surround us. May our Christmas be a time of healing, giving and sharing. May your spirit be with us as we care and share in Jesus' blessed birth. This we ask in the precious name of our Lord and Saviour, Jesus Christ. Amen. Today's scripture reading is taken from the Gospel of Luke chapter 2, reading verses from 8 to 14. There were some shepherds in that part of the country who were spending the night in the fields, taking care of their flocks. An angel of the Lord appeared to them, and the glory of the Lord shone over them. They were terribly afraid, but the angel said to them, Don't be afraid. I am here with good news for you, which will bring great joy to all the people. This very day, in David's town, your Saviour was born, Christ the Lord, and this is what will prove it to you. You will find a baby wrapped in strips of cloth and lying in a manger. Suddenly, a great army of heaven's angels appeared with the angel, singing praises to God. Glory to God in the highest heaven, and peace on earth to those with whom he is pleased. May the Lord add his blessings to the reading and hearing of his word. Hello everyone. I am Athiraj Pal of Grade 4 Section E and on the merry occasion of Christmas, I am going to present the song 10,000 Reasons by Matt Redman. Oh 
I bring Christmas greetings to you in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ on behalf of our Chairman Bishop N.L. Karkare, Madam Kamal Karkare, Principal, Manager, Teaching, Non-Teaching, Support Staff of Baldwin Boys High School. The message of Christmas. I would like to read a few verses from the Bible taken from Gospel according to St. John, chapter 1, verses 4 and 5. In Him was life, and the life was the light of men. The light shines in the darkness and the darkness has not overcome it. As we uh, go through this season, there is the question that comes to our mind. What is the purpose of Christmas? Bible says, in him was the life and the life was light of man. 
This verse is a masterpiece of planned ambiguity, open to more than one interpretation. Light and darkness are not simply polar opposite. Darkness is absence of light. When light shows up, darkness scatters, darkness disappears. Many times there is kind of darkness that we go through or live with. But when you welcome Jesus Christ, light comes in and your darkness, my darkness disappears. The question that is better to be asked here, why Jesus came in the flesh? Why divinity through back door? The birth could have been taken place in king's palace or Jerusalem, the citadel of religious power or in the holy temple of Jerusalem or in Athens, cradle of Greek culture and philosophy, isn't it? Why did God tabernacle through the back door? Bethlehem is a back door. Bethlehem is a nowhere place. Bethlehem is a sneaking in around through back door. Why did Jesus come in such an ignominious beginning? A stable, a cradle, swaddling clothes, no receiving blanket over there, no place for him in the inn. No nice place for him to be swaddled and cradled. Rags were used to swaddle him. He was warmed up by the breath of cows and sheep. When you, when you don't make room for him, I tell you, there is only darkness. When you don't make room for him, there is darkness. The greatest gift that you ever received came through back door in a nowhere town called Bethlehem with rags to swaddle him, with sheep and cows to keep him warm. Peasant girl called Mary and poor father Joseph. If you don't make room for him, there is always darkness in our life. Why there is Christmas? What is the purpose of Christmas? He came to bring life into our deadness. Jesus came to bring life into our deadness. He is the strength of our earthly life. He makes our earthly life possible. He is the secret of our effective life. He makes our effective life purposeful. He gives us an identity that's fit to live with. He gives us a faith that is fit to live by and He gives us a purpose that is fit to live for. If you do not have this, our identity to live with, our, our faith to live by and our purpose to live for, there is no joy at all in our life. There should be a festive look on our faces at all times and not the funeral look. He is the strength of our earthly life. He is the secret of our effective life. He is the source of our eternal life. He makes life possible. He makes life purposeful. He makes life permanent. I am traveling through a barren land. We are, we are pilgrims and one day God will bring us home in Jesus Christ our Lord. In Him there is life and that life is permanent. Bible says, God so loved the world that He gave His one and only begotten Son that whosoever believeth in Him shall not perish but have eternal life. He came to bring life in our deadness. Second and the last thought I want to place before you, He came to bring light into our darkness. Light shines in the darkness. It is not just the absence of light but the presence of Satan. That is why we sin in the dark. Not just the physical darkness but many times we are not informed properly, we are not educated properly, we are not guided properly, we are not led properly and sometimes our darkness is out of the ignorance that we live with like our head in the sand. We do our wrong in the dark under the false impression that nobody will come to know all that we do. We don't want our wrong 
come to the light but if you are child of God you step out of darkness and come to light and this light examines the life Jesus came to bring light into my darkness he made this historic statement I am the light of this world there is this there is this Pavamana mantra that we read in Brihad Aranyaka Upanishad one of the old Upanishads that we have where we read Asatoma Sadgamaya Tamasoma Jyotirgamaya Mrutyoma Amrutam Gamaya Peace, peace and let there be peace From ignorance lead me to truth From darkness lead me to light From death lead me to immortality and let there be peace the state of the state of awareness about the omniscient about the omnipresent about the omnipotent power present inside of you that is the enlightenment mentioned here in this mantra Jesus in us will lead us to this enlightenment he came to bring light into our darkness my dear friends Jesus is the light that shines in the darkness and the darkness comprehended him not when light shows up darkness scatters it has to flee with all of the stuff that is going on in this world right now take for example terrorist attack children being abused murders in the city threat of virus uncertainty of the time anti-conversion bill persecution the sense of insecurity that prevails don't let that terrify you don't let that frighten you don't let that put you down because we got somebody who is Lord above all greater is he who is in you than the one who is in this world and there is nothing that happens in our life that that Jesus cannot handle when he comes I tell you darkness disappears John chapter 1 verse 5 I read for you once again the light shines in the darkness and the darkness has not overcome it may God bless you all wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year
where there is hope love light and light the plan and purpose of god will reach let me read out a poem by catherine falsifer for you and this is our wish for each one of you for christmas and all through the coming year if i could wish a wish for you it would be for peace faith and happiness not only at christmas but for the whole year through i wish that there always be food on your table that you always give to those less fortunate may you always take time to share and thank those who have blessed you i wish for time so you may reflect on the blessings that you have and that you express your love to those who are dear to you may you never feel lonely because there are those who care then you realize you are special you are unique you make a difference not only at christmas but all year i wish for you thoughts to be positive ones that you never quit that you never give up and that you continue to learn i wish for the love and peace of god to be yours always may the true spirit of christmas shine in your heart and light your path god bless each one of you thank you My name is Avi Sharma and I'm going to sing Feliz Navidad by Jose Feliciano. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Prospero año de felicidad. Feliz Navidad Feliz Navidad Feliz Navidad prospero on you with felicidad I want to wish you a merry christmas I want to wish you a merry christmas I want to wish you a merry christmas from the bottom of my heart I want to wish you a merry christmas Feliz Navidad prospero on you with felicidad Feliz Navidad Feliz Navidad Feliz Navidad prospero on you with felicidad I want to wish you a merry christmas I want to wish you a merry christmas I want to wish you a merry christmas from the bottom of my heart I want to wish you a merry christmas I want to wish you a merry christmas I want to wish you a merry christmas from the bottom of my heart Merry Christmas to y'all
मोहब्बत का बादशाह मोहब्बत बन के आया रोशनी का खुदा रोशनी बन के आया रोशनी का खुदा रोशनी बन के आया Praise the Lord. My name is Ethan Stavan. I am studying in 5F and I am going to sing Angel from the Realms of Glory. Angel from the realms of glory, wing your flight o'er all the earth. He who sang creation story, now proclaim Messiah's birth. Watching o'er your flocks by night, God with man is now residing. Yonder shines the infant light. Gloria in excelsis Deo. Christmas greetings to everyone. I am Joshua Paul from Standard 7B. Today let's listen to the Christmas story. Christmas fills our hearts with joy as we think about gifts, lights and holiday spirit. But Christmas means something more. It's the birth of our Savior Jesus Christ. His birth was absolutely crucial for our salvation and yet he came to this world in a quiet and humble way. The tiny Christ child was a gift to us all. Let us travel back to Bethlehem and share the story of his birth. For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son, Jesus Christ, that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. The birth of Jesus Christ. This is how the birth of Jesus, the Messiah, came about. His mother Mary was pledged to be married to Joseph, but before they came together, 
she was found to be pregnant through the Holy Spirit. In those days, Caesar Augustus issued a decree that a census should be taken of the entire Roman world. And everyone went to their own town to register. So Joseph also went up from the town of Nazareth in Galilee to Judea, to Bethlehem, the town of David, because he belonged to the house and line of David. He went there to register with Mary, who was pledged to be married to him and was expecting a child. While they were there, this time came for the baby to be born, and she gave birth to a firstborn, a son. She wrapped him in clothes and placed him in a manger. The only place for a sleeping baby to rest was most likely in the animal straw known as the manger. And there were shepherds living out in the fields nearby, keeping watch over their flocks at night. An angel of the Lord appeared to them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were terrified. But the angel said to them, Do not be afraid, I bring you good news that will cause great joy for all the people. Today in the town of a David, Saviour has been born to you. He is the Messiah, the Lord, there will be a sign to you. You will find a baby wrapped in clothes and lying in a manger. Suddenly a great company of the heavenly host appeared with the angel, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest heaven, and on earth peace to those on whom his favour rests. When the angels had left them and gone into heaven, the shepherds said to one another, Let's go to Bethlehem and see this thing that has happened, which the Lord has told us about. So they hurried off and found Mary and Joseph and the baby, who was lying in the manger. When they had seen him, they spread the word concerning what had been told to them about this child. And all who heard it were amazed at what the shepherds said to them. But Mary treasured up all these things and pondered them in her heart. The shepherds returned, glorifying and praising God for all the things they had heard and seen, which were just they had been told. After Jesus was born, three wise men, also known as Magi, saw the brilliant star in the sky that rested over where Jesus was born. The three wise men traveled from a distant eastern country to find the new king. During the wise men's trip, King Herod met the wise men and told them to come back and let him know where the baby king was so that he could worship him as well. The wise men continued to Bethlehem and found Jesus right where the star pointed. They knelt and worshipped the Saviour and gave him gifts of gold, frankincense and myrrh. For unto us a child is born, to us a son is given, and the government will be on his shoulder, and he will be called Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. I wish you all a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year.
Hello there everyone, my name is Abhi Dipukumar. I'm studying in 7B and in this video I'm gonna be creating a Christmas tree. So let's begin. everyone. My name is Jerome Theodore Correra from Sunday 4. Christmas is a season to share joy and happiness and so I would like to share the same with you all with this song. Deck the halls with bars of holy fa la 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 Tis the season to be jolly fa la 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 don't we know our gay apparel fa la 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 troll the ancient yuletide carol fa la 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 see the blazing yule before us fa la 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 strike the harp and join the chorus fa la 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 Follow me in merry measure Fa la 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 Pass away the old year passes Fa la 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 Hail the new year lights and losses Fa la 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 Sing, sing with joy and song together Fa la 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 Christmas.
Hello everyone, I am Madhman Peter from class 3rd I will be presenting to you a dance on a special song of Jingle Bells. I like to be a Christmas tree with lots of colored lights on me. 
I shine my star so bright above to tell the world of Jesus love silent night holy night all is calm all is bright round me on virgin mother and child holy infant so tender and mild sleep Go, tell it on the mountains, over the hills and everywhere. Go, tell it on the mountain that Jesus Christ is born. That Jesus Christ is born. Ho, 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 dashing through the snow on one horse open sleigh. Over fields we go. Laughing all the way, ha, 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 bells on bottles ring. Making spirits bright, what fun it is to ride and sing a sleighing song tonight. Hey, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride on a one horse open sleigh. We wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Thank you. Red-nosed reindeer had a very shiny nose And if you ever saw it, you would even say it blows All of the other reindeer used to laugh and call him names They never let poor Rudolph join in any reindeer games Then one foggy Christmas Eve, Santa came to say so bright, won't you guide my sleigh tonight? Then how the reindeer loved him, as he shouted out with glee. Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer, you'll go down in history.
It's always good to remind ourselves what the Christmas season is really about by studying Bible verses about Christmas. The reason for the season is the birth of Jesus, our Lord and Savior. Here's a collection of Bible verses to keep you rooted in the Christmas spirit of joy, hope, love and faith. Isaiah 7:14 Therefore the Lord himself will give you a sign Listen carefully the virgin will conceive and give birth to a son and she will call him Emmanuel God with us Isaiah chapter 9 verse 6 For unto us a child is born unto us a son is given and the government will be upon his shoulders His name shall be called Wonderful Counselor, the Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. The Bible goes Matthew chapter 1 verse 21. And shall bring forth a son and you shall call his name Jesus, for he will save his people from their sins. Thank you. Hi, I'm Alvin. I'm going to tell you a memory verse. John chapter 3 verse 16. For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life thank you a reading from the book of luke chapter 2 was 10 to 12 don't be afraid i'm here with good news for you which will bring great joy to all the people this very day in david's town your savior was born christ the lord and this is what will prove it to you You will find a baby wrapped in strips of cloth and lying in a manger. Hello, my name is Joshua. I am from 6E. I am going to say the verse Luke chapter 2 verse 13 and 14. And suddenly there was with the angel a magnitude of heavenly host praising God and saying, Glory to God on the highest and on earth peace goodwill towards all men amen
my name is abhijan basu from class 6c today i am going to play rudolph the red nose in you
Hello everyone, I am Ms. V. Arjun Gowda of 9B. Today, I am going to make a Christmas model. So, let's start making. My Christmas model is ready. May God shower his blessings on all of us. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Thank you. Hello everyone, my name is S. Puneet Raj, studying in Bolvin Boys High School, 6th Standard A section. My topic is on Christmas speech. Christmas is a worldwide Christian festival celebrated in the month of December. In this day, people commemorate the birth of Jesus Christ on 25th December. 
It is famed for its decorations and Santa Claus was actually Saint Nicholas. In this day in the morning time a church mass is held and later in the day the whole family enjoys a delightful meal. Homemade traditional cakes, cookies, muffins and various desserts are the special treats on Christmas. Kids wear new clothes and dresses and receive lots of gifts. In India, there is a federal holiday on Christmas. The government offices and all the schools remain closed on this day. Kushwar, originating from Goa, is one of the traditional Indian Christmas sweets. The streets and shopping malls are decorated with different decorative items. A festival teaches us to love and help everyone and work towards the betterment of mankind. So enjoy your Christmas celebrations. Thank you. Hello everyone, I wish you all a very happy Christmas. Today I will be playing Mary's Boy Child. <laughs> from LKG B section. Let's start. 